Hi guys. So today I wanted to do a New Year's Eve tutorial and I was really inspired by this palette, an e.l.f. palette that had like a bunch of different pops of colors and I was going to do glitter and kind of hop on the bandwagon that everybody else was doing. But then I figured I wanted to do a look that a lot of people would be inspired to wear and something that they didn't have to go out and buy glitter for or just go out of their comfort zone or if they weren't even interested in wearing glitter at all. So I did something that personally I would wear, not just something that I was going to film. So I ended up using the It's Judy Time palette because it has so many beautiful neutrals in it and then it has three pops of color that are gorgeous. Who wouldn't want to wear these colors? So that's what I decided to like do. to see how I did this look then just keep watching. So first I'm going to be taking Maybelline Color Tattoo in Just Beige and applying that all over my eyelid and up to my brow bone. And this is going to make sure that my eyeshadows last all night long and make the colors more vibrant and also help them from not creasing. Now I'm going to be taking this matte medium brown from the It's Judy Time palette and it doesn't look medium brown in the picture but it is and I'm just going to be putting that into my crease. I'm going to be taking this deeper brown and I'm going to use an angled brush to make a kind of wing, wing dye effect with this and then I'm just going to be taking a tapered blending brush and blending this out. So it's okay if the wing looks a little messy like mine. Now with the blending brush that I first used, I'm going to go in and blend the look out just so that there's no harsh lines. Again with the angled brush and the dark brown color, I'm just going to take that underneath of my um, lash line and bring that about three-fourths of the way in. Now I'm taking ELF's cream eyeliner in a, just a black color and I'm just going to be lining my upper lash line and I'm just going to make the wing a little bit more dramatic than you would on an everyday basis. And when you're doing this, don't worry about your wing being even with your other one because it's just almost impossible so just try to get them as close as you can. I'm mixing these two bluish periwinkle colors I'm going to be putting them on my lower lash line in the um, inner portion and then I'm just going to be taking the shimmery blue and I'm going to be applying that above the uh, winged eyeliner and it's going to give it like a little sparkly pretty effect. I'm applying my Jordana Best Lash Extreme and I'm just going to be putting a ton of this on because I'm not wearing false lashes and I'm going to be applying this to my lower lashes as well. The color that I ended up putting on my lips was from Milani and it was number 20 in Uptown Mauve and it's just this really nice raspberry color and I think that it complements um, the uh, bluish colors that were in this palette that I used as a pop of color. So yeah, that's what I decided to do and this is what I am going to be wearing for New Year's because I like it and I think that it just, um, it's very, very wearable. 
and very glamorous still at the same time without having to put on tons of glitter and things like that. So, um, yeah. Thank you guys so much for watching, and I'll see you guys all in my next video. Bye. And have a happy new year, and I hope everybody had an awesome Christmas, because I did. So, bye. I mean, I have to feature my cats in my videos, because then I can look back at the videos and say, Oh my god, look how small they were. Oh, look how small he was. His name is Eli. And um, Gatsby's just getting used to him. He's a lot more friendly than Gatsby was. But, oh, Gatsby loves him. They love each other, though, right? Look, like, he's so cute and he's so small. He is, um, he's six weeks. He's going to be seven weeks this week. Wait, right? and he's, he, I just woke him up. He was laying on my desk. But isn't he so cute? Oh, he's so cute. Say bye.